What's poppin' you two? What's the word? You thizzle. What's the word? You tizzle. What's the word? You. What's going on, man? Hey, man. Today, man, we got Elvis bridge over troubled water. Now, look, I, bro, yo, I think I seen this before. Now, I seen a comment saying watch bridge over troubled water, but then I looked it up and I and this shit like it looked familiar. I'm pretty sure I seen this before, but I typed in Twano 2 a.m. And I typed the song in, and I didn't see a reaction, so I don't know how I haven't seen this. I'm pretty sure I've seen this before. I've seen this performance with him in this jumpsuit on like a million, trillion, billion, gazillion, lambzillion, lambillion times before. I definitely feel like I've seen this, but I'm going to watch this. I might not have seen it. I might just be tripping. This has 26 million views. I don't know how I wouldn't have seen this. This is crazy. The fact that I haven't seen this is crazy, but... We about to watch it though, let's go. This is crazy, I don't know how I haven't seen this before. When you This the thing sometimes though. First of all, I just watched Elvis' daughter and her mom on a and his mom his wife on a yeah Elvis' daughter and her mom I said it right the first time, bro. So I watched them do a little interview and they were saying how people it's like seventy some years later people still go to his house in in Graceland and they still do a candlelight for his um, death anniversary. Now look. Where is that at? Where is that? I might have to go out there. I might have to go out there next year. Because it might be too late this year. I don't know. Too late. This year, it's not in my schedule. I might have to go out there next year. I might have to just go out there the first chance I get. I definitely want to see the house. Um, this is crazy. But what I was going to say was... What was I going to say? Damn. I think that is what I was going to say. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. I this is the thing with this song right here. Sometimes, like I can't tell what he's saying. I don't know what he just said. Just then, I don't know what he just said. Let me see. Let me. Let me see. When you're weary. When you're weary. Okay. Feeling small. Hold on. All right, I'm back, y'all. My bad. I had an important phone call I had to pick up. We back. Let me see. Let's get it. When tears are... But I believe I was at the part where I was confused on what he was saying. Let me see. Oh, he said, when you're weary, that's right. All right, let's get it. Feeling small. When tears are... See, what did he just say right there? I know he said, when you're weary, when you're, when you're feeling small, when your tears are drowning in your eyes. And then he says something right here. I don't know what he, like some of these words at the, that he be stretching out at the end, I can't understand what he's saying, bro. Some of the words I can't understand. I don't know what he said right there. That was too soft. It was too soft to understand what he said. Sorry. And friends just can't be found like a bridge Okay, okay, oh, okay. And friends can't be found. Like a bridge over troubled water. Friends can't be found like a bridge over troubled water. What does that mean? Friends can't be found like a bridge over troubled water. What does that mean, though? 
friends can't be found like a bridge over troubled water. I don't know what that means. I will lay me down like a bridge over troubled oh, okay. water. I will lay me down. Okay, so he's saying that he will lay down like a bridge over troubled water. Okay, so he's saying he can be the solution. He can be the solution. When you're weary, when you're feeling low, and when your eyes are filled with tears, I will lay myself down like a bridge over troubled water. I get it. When you're down when you're on the street When an evening falls so hard I will comfort you I'll take your part Oh, time is rough Hold on, man. To be honest with you guys, the more I watch these older videos, I realize that this microphone right here was top tier. This microphone might be preferable over some microphones today. I think this microphone has a different sound when it comes to singing versus the typical microphones that's today. Like, you know how today we got the black microphone with the and everything? Uh... I, I could definitely hear the difference with this microphone right here. I think this microphone might be preferred over the other microphone in today's time, even today. Like, I'm pretty sure some singers would prefer to use this microphone over the typical black one. Because I know in a Righteous Brothers video, they had this same microphone. And I'm noticing that this microphone, it kind of can produce that sound of like, surround if that makes sense like it kind of has more of a like a fuller sound if that makes sense to you guys so this microphone might be top tier See, this is a very different type of Elvis performance than what I'm used to seeing because usually Elvis is doing like some, <laughs> I was going to say the word kinky. He's usually doing some kinky stuff, but kinky is not the word because kinky is more so like sexual and like when it comes to intercourse and stuff like that, like using anal beads, that's some kinky ass stuff. You know what I'm saying? Uh, fingers in the booty, that's some kinky ass stuff. You know what I'm saying? Fingers down the throat, that's some kinky ass stuff getting spit in your mouth, that's kinky. But Elvis' performance is not, <laughs> is not kinky, so, but I'm saying, I'm usually used to his performance and have, having more like jazz to it, more umph, more dancing, more of this type stuff. So, but I think in this, he's definitely way older. So this is a different kind of type of Elvis' performance right here. I never seen this type and he's this is like I actually like this sound. It's a good song. Still, I haven't found no song that's better than If I Can Dream, though. If I Can Dream, not even because of the meaning in that song, but just the sound of it. That If I Can Dream song is like that's the peak of Elvis's like talent to me. That's I want to hear that every time I react to Elvis. I want to hear something that sounds like that. There's a dog pissing on my car. No! Or oh, one 
rules when it comes to especially cars. Don't let, don't get in the car and touch the stereo. And don't let nobody touch your car. This lady, this old lady just let her dog come and take a piss on my rims. That's crazy. It's not a big deal. It's just my rims, but it's just like, damn, the principle of it. Like me personally, I wouldn't let nobody come and let their dog take a piss on somebody else's rims, you feel me? Sail on, silver girl. Sail on by. Your time has come to shine. All your dreams are on the way. See how they shine. was a banger that dog kind of took my mental away for a little minute that was a banger um let me know if I should watch more or what I should watch next of Elvis to be honest this wasn't one of my favorite Elvis performances though to be honest with you guys I damn near feel like I'm about to fall asleep it just doesn't do it for me the song is nice the performance is nice but I didn't. I didn't enjoy those four minutes, though. You know what I'm saying. I would rather much. I would love to watch "If I Can Dream" over this right here. This song is not for me at all. Um. I. I didn't really enjoy that one. That's probably the first Elvis song I really just didn't enjoy. Um. I'm out. Like, subscribe, comment. More bangers coming. That dog pissed on my rims. It's kind of fucked up. I just washed my car. I just cleaned my car, too. I'm debating if I even have the right to be mad or if I'm just overreacting. Like, should I be mad or am I just overreacting? It's just the rim. It's just like, damn, just seeing it happen, though. You feel me? Hey, I'm out, though. Let's get it. Hey, we're going. Let's go.